viral. What is going viral to you? Somebody might get 50,000 views. You did that much. Somebody might get 50,000 views and go and think they went viral. You'd be like, yeah, 50,000 people seen it, but then after that, what? That is a lot of people. Yeah. If you put all those people in one room, <laughs> you, you got an arena. Yeah. So people don't understand, like, it don't don't look at people with big numbers. You got to understand, yeah, I got 7.8, but you got somebody like Selena Gomez with 143 million. Right. And I ain't sitting up here complaining like, man, I'm trying to, I ain't like Selena Gomez. My life is over. No, it ain't. I'm doing good by little seven point eight. I'm straight. We still marching. So it's like, as long as you get a following and get a viewing, keep going. Those people are watching you. So feed your fans. <laughs> <laughs> so Jess, do you find that it's tougher for you being a female comedian in the industry? Honestly, no. I really don't. I don't find that it's tough. I um, I just. <sighs> I don't find that it's tough. Um, I'm a very strong woman, and uh, and I just, you know, I make it work for me, man. I'm not. I've never been afraid to get in front of a crowd of people, you know, and just talk. So, man, even at it started at family reunions. I'd be funny in church at funerals. I try to make everybody laugh everywhere. Yeah. So, you know, I, I always, you know, I always said I was hammered. You know, when you got something, when it's you just got that something, and you don't know what it is. You destined just to go far for real. It's not. It's not hard for me at all. Mm -mm. In D.C., you're a new father. So is there anything that you've had to sacrifice in order to excel in fatherhood? Uh, time. You know what I'm saying? Like, people be with their children every day. You know what I'm saying? It be days I be going without being with my daughter physically. But, you know, thanks to FaceTime, I could be there still. But, you know, it's that physical stuff. You can't substitute being a father with FaceTime. You're not there, my G. Just because you watch it, you, you're not there. You know what I'm saying? Those feelings don't come through the phone. So being able to walk home and she like, Daddy, love you. you like, what? The, you know what I'm saying? Like, those feelings be like, oh, that, you know what I mean? So it's like, you can't get those back. But those, those are the moments that I have to, you know what I mean, sacrifice in order for me to provide for her to make sure she don't go through what I went through. And I'm sure y'all both have some things in the pipe. So what can we expect from y'all in 2019? Man, just with the mess, going somewhere. I ain't gonna tell you where, but it's going somewhere. Podcast. No. Nope. Okay. What about? I can't tell you. Oh, no, 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 it's not. It's not. She just trying patience, patience is a virtue. Patience is a virtue. What about you, DC? Uh. <laughs> 85 South Show, we, we, we about to turn up, we about to do big platforms with it uh, I got more comedy tours that I'm with, I'm with my guests, comedy tour, my own tour uh, 85 South Show tour, I got a couple TV shows that I'm working on, that I'm producing um, I got the hook up to dropping uh, in May um, How High to dropping in April 20, on 420, that's the smoke me, Lil Yachty, uh, who else gonna be in there? Mike Epps gonna be in there, Top Notch gonna be in there. You gonna be in, um, um, I got the hookup to, uh, um, woo, it's so many people in there. Y'all gotta see, they got so many people in there. Um, and then I got a movie coming out with Jay Farrer and, um, Cat Williams called, um, Two Minutes of Fame dropping in, in, in September. You gonna be in there too? You in the, I I'ma be in Two Minutes of Fame. Oh, my brother is in Two Minutes of Fame, yes. So we are in there, my twin brother. Um, uh, you gone, big brother? You gone? Oh, all right, all right. Um, but then after that, yeah, uh, my music, my album, Trap Soul, did went top ten on R&B uh, soul charts. So make sure you go get that on all platforms, Apple Music, iTunes, and I got another um, project about to drop again called Fly Woman. He didn't kill me. Um. So after this, um, I'm going to be hosting the Emmys, um, and next year they said they was going to give me the Oscars and the Espies, and um, <laughs> it's just like, no, I'm fucking with you. I was like, oh shit. I'm fucking with you. <laughs> fucking with you. <laughs> so what does the end goal look like for the two of y'all? The end goal? Ain't no end goal. Nah, I can't go back to selling crack. <laughs> I can't, no, 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 it's, it's, it's no end, you know, it's no end goal, we just gotta keep going gotta keep Actors, going. actresses, just artists, dance, man, we got too much, too much to just to stop wow, And it will never, stop. yeah, wow. limitless yeah. No. Are there any entrepreneurial endeavors in the works anymore? Nigga, yes, producer, a whole producer, um, I don't know, I'd probably, probably buy a couple schools, you know what I'm saying, bub shops, all that Beauty schools? Nah, like Education, 
like with Steph Curry and LeBron doing. Oh, um, you know they got money. They, you know they, they got money to actually like pay the people to teach it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't need a lot of volunteers. No, we no, no. We we gonna do it. We gonna we do it. We need the building, but we gonna need a lot of volunteers. Y'all can support each other and volunteer yeah, at each other's schools. I never get the building, but uh, you know, paying the workers. I don't have time for this. Come to work. Okay. Do it for the hood. Well, we definitely appreciate y'all for being here on thisis50.com. Yes, and we will be tuned in tomorrow. It's live, right? Yes, oh, yes we'll be tuned in tomorrow to the BET Social Awards. Once again, this is DC Young Fly and Just Hilarious signing out. I did not. I did not.